Hey, hi. Uh, this video is uh, just the explanation for sorting of an array in Python. Uh, so we have an array called Bert that has three elements in it, which is mat, cat, and bat. And my expectation is to sort it into bat, cat, and mat. So in order to achieve that, I first have to compare when I compare it, so say I have the three elements, so I compare mat with cat and then mat with bat and cat with mat and cat with bat and then bat with mat and cat. So every time I have to compare, when I find that one element is larger than the other, I swap. This is the most simplest explanation I can give for that problem. So let's go here and uh, look into it. So, so I'm going to take for loop because I have to iterate it in number of times so that I, I get all the elements and it's sorted. So I'm taking for loop. I'm taking the for loop to iterate with the length of the word. So when I say length of words, I'm saying the length of the array with words, which is going to be two. So I, I loop is going to be iterating two two times uh, I mean 0 1 and uh, 2 so it starts from 0 and it is going to be uh, going until 2 and similarly I have J which is also going to start from 0 and it will go until 2 I have the logic if J is going to be greater than uh, words of I then I swap so assume that you have this thing you have words let's say I have I with this and I have J. So I have words of I and I have words of J. Okay, the reason why I'm putting this is like so that uh, it would be easy for us to actually go over the program and assume that uh, and uh, we can easily, uh, you know, correlate it and uh, do the swapping. So I have a condition that when the words of I is are greater than words of I, words of J greater than words of I, and then I swap. This is a simple swap logic. Swap is not so where you use a temporary variable, you assign the particular uh, variable that needs to get swapped. So you're using words of I, you put that in this temp, and then you use words of I equals to words of J, and then words of J becomes temp. That is how you do the swapping. So. So let's say that I have the words, I have this words like 0, 1, 2. The first time when um, I want to make the program look so confusing, so I would rather remove it from here. And uh, we'll go here. So I have here. So, so I have my for loop. So as the program gets initialized, your temporary variable is initially going to be zero. I have my i. The i will i is going to begin from zero. So first time it is going to be zero, and j is also going to be zero. So when I say for loop of i is equal to zero and j is equal to zero, let's see what I am um, what I'm trying to mean here. So this is going to be my j, which is cat, man, cat, and bat, and I is going to be cat, mat, and bat. So for i is equals to zero means so this is my zeroth position, and this is my first, and this is my second. So when i is equals to zero, I mean mat. So the word mat uh, gets compared with J words, which is mat, cat, and bat. So we have condition. So for the first time, it is going to be mat, and here it is going to be mat, cat, and bat. So words of J are greater than words of I. So is mat greater than mat? No. Is cat greater than mat? 
no is bad greater than not no so for the i iteration of i so when i is going to be 0 and j is going to be and j is going to be 0 1 2 which is 0 1 2 your 0 is cat and your 1 is uh, 0 is mat and your 1 is cat and your 2 is bat so for j, j is equal to 0 1 2 and for i is equal to 0 nothing really happens this logic never gets executed at all because the element that you are comparing with is going to be mat mat so and this is from i so this is going to be i element but your logic is actually when will you actually do the swap you are doing the swap when words of j is greater than words of i so words of j is this thing so cat is definitely not greater than mat and bat is definitely not greater than mat and mat is definitely not greater than mat so i zero iteration nothing really happens so come to the uh, second value is going to be one so your i second value is cat is equal to cat so yeah uh, so for so the for loop for the value of your i is equals to one and j will always be zero one two so it is not getting that this time my i is equals to 1 in this case it's going to be cat so you have words of j greater than words of i so is mad greater than cat it's true so what happens is you have this is cat greater than mat? So it is true so because it's true. You use your temporary variable. And you put temp is equals to cat, and you put cat is equals to mat, and mat is equals to cat. You're basically switching the position of this cat and mat by doing this logic. And why we are doing this now? This time it is your i is cat and your word is words from j is mat. And it is go over here. So when the, on the first iteration, I mean not first iteration, I mean when the value of i is equals to one and for the value of j is equals to zero, you are finding the condition to be true. So during that time, this, this swap is getting executed. So your word array is going to become. What will it happen? So it will become cat. And it will become mat. And bat. So by the end of i is equals to 1 and j is equals to 0, it becomes cat, mat and bat. So for j is equal to 0, it is this case now, but uh, now if you look at it, your value of i has got changed now. So when we started the, uh, when we started the for loop, so let's say here, so when we started the for loop, it was, one was cat, right? Your words was like, you know, so it looks like this, so on the zeroth iteration, So on the zeroth iteration, it was this condition didn't really get executed, so no swap happened. But on the first, on the uh, on iteration, it becomes cat, mat, and bat. Now, uh, when i was one and uh, j was zero, it got swapped. So this cat as now is now becoming mat 
so every time it is going to be mat this condition will not get executed at all because we know that mat is um, so it comes here so the mat gets compared with mat mat gets sorry the mat this one gets compared with mat and this gets compared with mat and this gets compared with mat obviously these three words are not greater than mat and this is not going to get executed so uh, that's that happens with the ith iteration so now we'll go to second one second i mean the value of i is going to become two uh, two not two it's going to become two so what is the value of uh, zero this is zero and this is one and this is two so this time your value becomes bad and what do you have in your uh, so what do you have in your array now you have let's change this so now you compare bat with cat you compare bat with mat and you compare bat with bat so you can ignore this case so you compare it with cat and bat what happens is so cat uh, so according to this condition words of j greater than words of i your cat is definitely greater than bat so for the value i is equals to 2 and j is equals to 0 so j is equals to 0 because your cat is 0 now and your mat is one and your bat is two so so for two zero i mean i is equals to two and j is equals to zero there's going to be a swap so during this swap your temp will become the word of i word of i will become word of j and word of j will become temp so what happens by this iteration so we were comparing uh, bat so what happens is bat gets swapped with the cat so it becomes cat becomes mat, mat, cat so this was our initial array it becomes this during the first swap where these two words got interchanged so the second swap is between this and this word so it so bat goes here and cat comes here so so i is equals to bat and cat is larger so we swapped it so now it becomes that and so it becomes cat so for i is equals to 2 and j is equals to 0 the swap is already done uh, now the next swap is going to be i is equals to 2 and j is equals to 1. In that case, i is equals to 2, what is your 2? So this time this word becomes it becomes bat and it becomes cat. Second iteration and zero uh, element gets swapped. So uh, okay. So this time I will become cat. 
Thank you. Why I every time change the I value also because in it, when the I was 2, initially it was bad, but the swap has happened. Now it has become cat. So 2, 0 will not repeat again, but 2, 1 will repeat. So is cat greater than mat? Which is true. I mean, the mat is greater than cat, so which is uh, which is true, it will swap. So the cat gets swapped for the mat. So your third iteration is going to become. So this two will swap. It will become bad and cat. So that's pretty much it. So when I say third, it is not like it is going to be a third iteration it's itself. I'm just saying that it's going to be your i is going to be two, and we can call it as third iteration, but your i is still going to be two. The values in it is getting changed because we have we are changing it using this temporary variable. So first time, first time this gets compared, so Matt and get can, gets compared and gets swapped. So the cat comes here, mat goes here, and the bat still lies here. Second time, I'm going to use. Uh, yeah, second time, I'm going to compare the cat and the bat. So the bat comes here and the cat goes here. Third time, I'm going to compare cat and the man. So it gets sorted. So that's pretty much it and uh, thank you.